So now you're extracting my platelets, correct? Yeah, we're making it into the small syringes so I can then use that on your hair and then the majority will keep and use it for your elbow. And so what's the difference between getting a PRP shot and a cortisone shot? Like what's what's the benefits? Well, PRP, uh, cortisone reduces inflammation, but it actually can weaken the tendon. It can sometimes lead to a rupture of the tendon. Uh, plus it has systemic side effects such as water retention, weight gain, osteoporosis. Uh, PRP has none of that. It's your own blood. So it, it does reduce inflammation just as good as cortisone, but helps regenerate the tissue, helps it to heal and regenerate, strengthen your tendon. Cortisone weakens it, so it's whether you want to strengthen your tendon or weaken it. So if I want to strengthen my tendon, I do PRP. If I want to weaken it, I get cortisone yes. shots? Yes, well, you are in effect weakening it when you get a cortisone injection. So do you think that eventually cortisone will be phased out with PRP? I think it will be. It less and less. We still offer it to patients because it's kind of the standard treatment, but we inform them that we've gotten far better results uh, um, for that. So now we've saved four cc's of the PRP that I'm going to use in your elbow. Okay. And then the remainder four cc's I'm going to do with your hair. So I'll videotape the uh, the elbow injection, but I'm not going to do the one my forehead injection. Actually, I will. I'll just do well, a selfie. We can have uh, Stacy do that for you. Okay, but I'm also not fully dressed. But okay, cool. But okay, cool. So yeah, I'm, we're going to start then with um, the injections to my elbow. Correct. That's going to be the first. Right. right. Okay. So, so you... stay tuned for the next video, and we will be doing injections to this elbow that I have. I got golfer's elbow from playing too much tennis and hopefully this will help me recover so I can play again like Rafael Nadal. <laughs>